One fine morning, Rabbit left his house and headed outside for a day of gardening. Ah, what a lovely day. Sunny, breezy. <coughs> what on earth? <laughs> Hi, Rabbit. Beautiful morning, isn't it? <coughs> well, yes, I uh, suppose. A bit dirty, perhaps. <laughs> you think? I hadn't noticed. Well, see you later. Well, I never. All right, well, let's try this again. <laughs> Oh, a whole day with nothing to do but weed and prune. La di di, la di da, la di da. <laughs> Why must Pooh leave his honey pots on the path where others walk? <laughs> oh, 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 there you are. I've been looking all over for you. Are you all right, Rabbit? Is there something wrong? <laughs> no, Pooh. <laughs> what could possibly be wrong? I don't know. Bye, Rabbit. Well, I never. <gasps> What's this? Oh, my poor squash. They've all been squashed. How did this happen? <laughs> the Tigger? Oh, I might have known. <laughs> now this really is the limit. Oh, this sort of behavior is just not acceptable. Something must be done. Yes. <laughs> and I have just the way to do it. <laughs> All right, everyone. Of late, I have uh, observed that there is much room for improvement in the Hundred Acre Wood. And in the interest of making life better for all, I have created this suggestion box. Oh, how wonderful. What is a suggestion box, Rabbit? Uh, well, uh, you just drop your suggestion in this box like so. <laughs> oh, and uh, all suggestions will be anonymous, of course. Oh, of course. <laughs> What's that? Well, anonymous simply means we won't sign our names to our suggestions. <laughs> that way, we will all feel free to write down what's really on our minds. Oh, hey! Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. And when it came time for the weekly meeting, the box was filled to the brim with suggestions. <laughs> well, I see that you all feel as I do, that uh, there is much room for improvement in the Hundred Acre Wood. <laughs> now, let's see here. Um, acorns might grow on lower branches where a smallish animal might more easily reach them. Hmm. Good suggestion, Piglet. Oh, thank you, Pooh. Yes, yes, but not terribly practical, so let's move on. <clears throat> I suggest that perhaps clouds could come in a wider variety of colors. Well, oh, I love that. Good idea. Good idea. Oh, now here's a particularly helpful suggestion. Certain small bluebirds should sweep their porches a bit more carefully so they don't dump debris on the head of certain friends of theirs. Oh, I didn't realize... Uh, sorry. Fine. <clears throat> Certain bears shouldn't leave their honey pots sitting where others might step in them. Who do you think he means? And... Certain tiggers should keep their feet out of certain gardens. Well, Tigger? How can I bounce in there if I gotta keep my feet out? Excuse me, I'm not done yet. And finally, the wood can benefit from each and every one of you. I mean us. Uh, generally being less silly and confused all the time. <laughs> well, I believe that's the last one. <laughs> See you at next week's meeting. <laughs> oh, this suggestion box was a wonderful idea, if I do say so myself. <laughs> oh, think of all the improvements we'll be able to make around here. <laughs> Perfect for us, where soon they'll all be seeing just how helpful I am being in a perfect forest, a perfect forest where everyone is taking.
liking the suggestions that I make. A food bear will be slimmer, cause I'll put him on a diet. Tigger won't be bouncy when I ask him to be quiet. He or will be smiling when I tell him not to grumble. The bees won't be so buzzy when I tell them not to bumble. Yes, the forest will be sheer perfection. How they'll benefit from each suggestion. My suggestion box will make them see how happy they will be if they do everything like me. A perfect forest, a perfect forest. They'll get into the habit of consulting with the rabbit in a perfect forest, a perfect forest where everyone is taking the suggestions that I make. Cassie will be tidier when sweeping up her nest, and Owl will soon discover using shorter words is best. Piglet won't be frightened, cause I'll tell him to be bolder. Who won't be so childish when I tell him to be older? It's a paradise without a question, when they benefit from my suggestion. Yes, my little box will save the day, they'll never go astray if they do everything I say. A perfect forest, a perfect forest, I'm sure that everybody will agree. They'll be hippy, happy, happy when the forest is as perfect as me. In the days that followed, Rabbit was very busy coming up with new suggestions. And the more he examined the behavior of his friends, yeah. the more fault he seemed to find. Oh. Oh. That tigger should be tidier. <laughs> And so, my great-grandfather on my mother's side, the son, of course, to my... Owl great... stories really are far too long. He really should try to shorten them. Great-grandfather on my father's side. You know, that Pooh really ought to watch what he eats. And when it came time for the next meeting, the box was filled with rabbit suggestions. A certain Pooh Bear should watch what he eats as he's getting a bit roundish. I usually do watch it as it's going into my mouth. <laughs> and then after that, it gets a bit more difficult. Certain donkeys should stop acting gloomy because everyone finds it too sad. That's kind of sad when you think about it. I wonder if certain suggestions aren't making us feel bad. Yes, Piglet. It, it certainly seems that way, doesn't it? Oh, don't be so thin-skinned. It's for your, I mean, our own good. Here's another. Rabbit's garden smells. <gasps> My garden smells. <laughs> that, that, that's not even a suggestion. Who wrote this? Oh, I see. Won't own up to it, eh? Well, I never. <laughs> Rabbit's garden smells. It smells fine to me. Who would write such an insulting thing? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. <clears throat> I've called this emergency meeting because of the small issue of, uh, well, that is to say, it's... I want to know who wrote Rabbit's garden smells. Come forward and explain what you uh, meant. Rabbit. I think there's something written on the back of that suggestion. On the back? Well, it just says wonderful. Oh, I wrote that one, Rabbit. Couldn't fit all the words on one side of the paper, so I finished it on the other side. Should say, Rabbit's garden smells wonderful. Well, it does. Yeah, well, uh, uh, this, this changes things considerably. Uh, 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 but you all can see, though, why, why I was insulted. It seemed hurtful before I knew about that. So, uh, Rabbit, I, I, I guess you're saying that one small criticism made you feel pretty badly. Yes, yes, I see what you mean, Piglet. Oh, my. You must have all felt awful at all the things I was saying. Oh, well, I'm sorry. Yeah, sort of. Uh, I guess I got carried away. You <laughs> Well, I suppose this means meeting is adjourned. Oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Uh, <clears throat> it seems I have one more suggestion here. Uh, here it is. Uh, certain friends of a certain bunny 
should know that they are very good friends indeed. And that that certain bunny, what I'm trying to say is, I love you all, and uh, well, <clears throat> I wouldn't change a thing about you. And that is the story of how Rabbit found that a word of praise can make 